Chapter 2. All About Cholesterol Again and again, food and diet has been named as the major culprit for causing health problems around the world. High blood pressure or hypertension is now a very big problem. It is considered the number one killer in America, and perhaps in many other countries around the world. Undoubtedly, a person with a high blood pressure is facing many risks in relation to health. There are many complications and diseases associated with having high blood pressure. The truth of the matter is this trend is quite unsurprising. With the fashion in which we are eating nowadays, it is easy to see why high blood pressure is a problem. Considering the current eating trends around the world, it is inevitable that health has suffered. We all eat too much of the wrong things. The fast food culture is proving to be surprisingly strong. Many of us prefer to eat junk food because it is convenient and easily available. Children are growing obese and adults are growing unhealthy. Our current culture makes it difficult for us to make healthy choices. The current lifestyle choices of modern man are often very unhealthy. Furthermore, it gets even more confusing for people nowadays because there are so many fly-by-night diet trends and diet rules. It gets difficult to figure out which diets are truly beneficial to your health and which ones are just a passing fad. There are an abundance of different kinds of diets to choose from. It gets difficult to pick which one will be right for you. Many people are concerned about their appearance but are not truly concerned about their health. In effect, you have teenagers who choose to starve themselves in order to look like the people they see on magazines. Health is more than just about having a nice body. It means having a body which functions properly. High blood pressure is a serious problem. It prevents your body from functioning properly, and it might also lead to the development of other diseases. The number of people who are suffering from high blood pressure is growing by the day, and it's surprising that we aren't taking this problem as seriously as we should. Many are already suffering, and many more will suffer if the proper steps are not taken. If you know that you have high blood pressure, don't ignore it. It can lead to serious complications which could possibly damage your health and your body permanently. If you don't get the proper medical attention that you need, you might end up with very serious problems. The good news is that there is no reason for you to panic. You can easily take control of the situation if you can make a commitment to a healthier lifestyle. Why does cholesterol matter? For the past few decades or so, cholesterol has always been seen as the enemy. It was seen as the reason for heart failures, and it was blamed for many things. People feared cholesterol, and the rule in every household was to keep it as low as possible. While there are certain studies which now claim that cholesterol should not be demonized, it should still be monitored well to ensure that a person's body will continue to function well. Here's a little surprise. You actually need cholesterol in your body. It is essential to life and is needed by cell membranes. It is classified as a lipid and it is found in most animals. Even though it is a fat, it is essential to certain metabolic processes. In fact, most of our cholesterol is produced by the liver and most of the cells in the body. It helps in many biological processes like the absorption of vitamin D. Cholesterol is useful but it has to be monitored. Health experts recommend that cholesterol should not exceed 5.5 mmol per liter. Those with pre-existing risk factors should aim for lower cholesterol. Unfortunately, a huge number of us ignore these numbers and recommendations. Most of us have a high cholesterol count. If a person has too much cholesterol circulating in his or her bloodstream, it can get quite dangerous. Too much cholesterol can cause blood vessels to narrow and eventually be blocked. When blood vessels are blocked, it can lead to many different diseases like stroke or various heart diseases. There are many factors which affect a person's cholesterol levels. Some people are more likely to have high blood pressure because of genetics and family background. Others may have it because of a related medical condition like an underactive thyroid gland, overconsumption of alcohol, and obesity. Some risk factors are more dangerous than others and should be taken into account. It is important to look at a person's overall lifestyle in order to figure out the best possible solution to the problem. Perhaps the most noticeable and controllable factor in preventing high blood pressure is monitoring a person's diet. While people's bodies might react differently, even if they eat the same thing, switching to more health-conscious food choices will very likely improve a person's health conditions. 
Generally speaking, eating foods that are low in saturated fat can really help improve a person's overall health. The majority of those who have high blood pressure do not show the symptoms of the condition. People over 20 years of age should ideally have their blood pressure checked at least once every year to ensure that they are in good condition. They should even take the tests more often if they are in the high-risk group. Consult your doctor or healthcare provider to find out how often you should take the test.